at this one. From what far away age hast thou come? Thy scent is very human indeed, but not intolerable. Ah, Princess Dusk's savior. Thine aura is precisely as she described. I thank thee deeply for rescuing her highness. But Princess Dusk is here no longer, snatched away by that horrifying primeval human. And so I must ask, couldst thou once more play the savior? Thank you. I am Elizabeth, guardian of this sanctuary. Something of a godmother to Princess Dusk. I shall assist thee to my utmost, for I am one with the sorceries of Uraseel. Thou shalt see an abyss was begat of the ancient beast, and threatens to swallow the whole of Uraseel. Knight Artorius came to stop this, but such a hero has nearly a murmur of dark. Without doubt, he will be swallowed by the abyss, overcome by its utter blackness. Indeed, the abyss may be unstoppable. Still, I have faith that Princess Dusk may be rescued yet. So I'm recording this after the fact and I just want to say this is my very first time as you see right here fighting Artorius and I cannot tell you how much this how fun this fight was it was it it blows my mind that even in the very first game in the series they they nailed it they fucking nailed it. They nailed it I'm almost as good as Artorius just nailed me upside the head with that fucking great sword. Ah, oh, that was a good move. Artorius is fighting with one broken arm, by the way. That's that's just badass. Just everything about this fight is badass, and I shouldn't have chugged that three times. I I did it three times, only meant to do it two. So that cost me a little bit. That was a cool flip. This is fucking awesome. Ooh! Ooh! This is my first time fighting him. I was in the fucking zone, man. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, I was in the zone. I about died. I honestly about died a couple of times. But I swear, I had never fought Artorius before this. I'd never even seen any videos of people fighting him. But I went into this fight completely blind, and I killed him my first time. And that is just amazing. This fight was phenomenal. And I... I the cutscene you get for killing Artorius before fighting Sif and freeing Sif is worth it. Do not, free, do not kill Sif until after you kill Artorius and, and rescue him. Please, just do yourself a favor. You. Is that not... The soul of the man who fell on this spot? He was a dear friend. I wish to pay proper respect with that soul. Would you be willing to... Yes, of course. I must not be presumptuous. Artorius would not have approved. <laughs> you humans, always taking what you please. And I shall do the same. How? 
You humans. And yeah, Chester, I love you to death, but I like your armor, so you're dead. You're gonna die. You get pancaked. Oh, it's come to blows, has it? Fine, there. I've had enough of you anyway. You're free, little dude. You're free. Love you, Seth. You're my favorite little doggo. Ow! The Furtive Pygmy. Not this time, motherfucker. I know all your attack patterns now, and I'm basically fantasy Batman. <laughs> it's my favorite line from any zero punctuation.
Thank you, Seth. Thank you. There's the bonfire. I'm gonna rest at it. And then the DLC's done. I've, I don't know how to describe what I'm feeling. I feel satisfied, but at the same time, I love this game.
Huh. This looks like Uyasel. This looks like the bridge from the Sanctuary Garden. This is the same place. Holy hell. I never knew I never even knew that. There's a comment on one of Vati Vidya's prepared cries about Sith and Artorius. It states that you're not really fighting Sith if you did the DLC beforehand. Sith is training you. Sith doesn't want what happened to Artorius to happen to you also. And therefore, he grabs Artorius' sword and tests you wanting you to prove to him that you are strong enough to handle what lies in store for you inside the abyss. Buddy. He doesn't want to... He just wants to train me. Make sure I'm prepared for what I have to face. I don't want to do this, Seth. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Damn. I'm so sorry, Seth. Go be with Artorius. And if it won't be for nothing. 